Resilient is a real estate investment trust listed on the JSC. We're 12 years old. We're very focused. We're a specialized fund. Uh, we focus on retail, regional malls, dominant regional malls, with a preference for non-metropolitan areas. So our flagship mall is probably Mall of the North in Polokwane. Our other large malls, the Boardwalk in Richards Bay, um, Ilunga in Nelspruit, uh, Highfeld Mall in Whitbank, and uh, Jabalani Mall in, uh, in Jabalani. We've just bought two new malls, uh, one called Jubilee Mall in Hamans Kral, which is the dominant mall in the area. We're really quite excited about that. And we bought Arini Mall, which is not typically the, our, our focus market, but we really like the area. It's growing very rapidly, and in time we'll expand Arini Mall. What also differentiates us is that we develop malls we extend our own malls, but we also develop new malls, both on our own and in partnership with other companies. Um, another differentiator probably is that we own shares in other companies, fairly large stakes. A company that uh, many people are probably are aware of is New, new Europe Property Investments. It's a Romanian property developer and retail mall owner. It's now the largest retail operator in Romania, and that was really founded with in partnership with Resilient. Earlier today we announced our annual results. We're really excited about them. I think they're the best results we've um, achieved in the since listing 12 years ago. A growth of 20.94% uh, growth in distributions. Um, the principal reason for this fantastic growth is we benefited from the depreciation of the RAND. Clearly that's a, a one-off, but we also, our property portfolio uh, was also very solid. We were excited about that. Sales growth ahead of industry average and well ahead of uh, inflation as well in a tough uh, retail environment. The um, forecast growth for the next financial year, difficult to forecast, but we forecast approximately 12%. Clearly the uh, RAND has a big impact on our distributions because of our unhedged exposure to offshore holdings. And uh, so we, it's clearly there's a caveat on on where the, uh, the, the RAND moves to, but based on current RAND exchange rates, we're happy with the 12%. We've in fact, uh, our forecast is based on 12, uh, 14 uh, RAND to the euro, 12.20 to the US dollar. We have a joint venture with Standard Bank and ShopRite in Nigeria. It's one of the new areas of our business. Um, it's been established two years ago. We are building two malls at the moment with seven additional malls in our pipeline. Nigeria is a tough market. It's a very exciting market. I think you know, everybody's aware of the growth rates that Nigeria achieves, but a very difficult market to establish yourself in. Um, but the economy is growing at between 6 and 7% a year, and it's one of the least uh, developed retail markets in the world at this, at this stage. So uh, an exciting area going forward. We may consider listing that company next year. It's, early, it's still early days and no decisions being taken. But uh, our intention is to grow that into a large listed REIT similar to what's been achieved with NEPI.